been at St John's for a very long time and I absolutely love every single moment of being here. So for me the school is all about the boys, little boys who come into St John's just full of energy and eagerness to learn. There are five pillars of St John's. First of all, academic excellence. All the boys work hard, it's cool to be academic, so the grade is raised. So academic excellence translates down into the pre-prep as read, 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 365 days of the year. The reading program is the heartbeat of the school. They come down here to the library and they have a teacher who's dedicated to assisting them get a reader that's at their level and they choose that particular reader for that day that they want to explore. So it makes children feel like they're active participants in their own learning. We have lovely dedicated teachers that nurture seeds knowing they'll one day be mighty oaks. There are two teachers in the classroom, a class teacher and an intern. We're privileged enough to have interns in every classroom that assist the teacher. They benefit a whole lot from St John's but we benefit hugely from having them here. And then we have the specialist teachers who come into the classrooms for sport, drama, music, art, Zulu, Susutu, Afrikaans and ICT. And these are kind of the subjects that create that confident and holistic child. We're lucky to have such lovely facilities. So the classrooms are big and airy and filled with light. And it was designed with pre-primary children in mind. The Anglican ethos that we purport particularly down in the pre-prep and I know through the rest of the school is about light, life and love. And it's about loving everybody. So we speak about social emotional learning, inquiry-based curriculum, social justice, spirituality. But when we teach the Bible stories like David and Goliath, it's about a little boy knowing right from wrong and being able to stand up for himself. So it's very inclusive of everybody. It's not about being a Christian. It's about loving your neighbor and being generous and kind and honest. And that's what we encourage the boys to be. Sport is huge. It's compulsory all through the school, starting down in the pre-prep. Down here we do the traditional sports, swimming, cricket, soccer, hockey and rugby. Children truly, truly need to be active at a young age. And it's not just about the fun and winning, it's also the fact that there's so many values that sports teaches, whether it's collaboration, teamwork, sportsmanship, losing with a little bit of grace. It's an integral part of our curriculum. We encourage the boys all to do a musical instrument and the boys absolutely love that. There's not a single little boy that doesn't like to sing and dance and play an instrument. Part of our community are the parents. We really like the parents to be involved in the boys' lives, so they're invited to come into the classroom. We want you to come in and put your little boy's bag down and make sure that he's happy. We also have the academic support space that houses the academic support teacher. We have a psychologist on site, and we have an occupational and speech therapist. The way we teach ethos and our religious beliefs is all very much based on love and kindness and what is going to build character. So as they're growing, they get more and more confident in who they are. It's imperative to us to be able to give the structure that a child needs and any support that they desire to be able to be ready for the next phase of learning as they head into the prep school.